Vice President Kamala Harris is in the Bay Area as part of a nationwide tour and campaign focusing on reproductive rights and the upcoming election. She delivered remarks at the Mexican Heritage Plaza in East San Jose today, and Crown Force Teresa Estacio was there. Here in San Jose, Vice President Kamala Harris here to talk and address the fight against reproductive rights. This is a fight that is fundamental, and it is fundamentally about freedom. California passed legislation following the United States Supreme Court decision to overturn Roe v. Wade. Ms. Harris applauded the move to those gathered and stressed the importance to continue pushing against efforts to create a national ban as well as restrict access to medical abortions. The freedom to make decisions about your own body and understand as we step back there is, and I travel our country, there is a foot, a full-on intent to attack hard-fought, hard-won freedoms in our country. Just look at what is happening. In addition to Ms. Harris, local, state, and federal leaders were in attendance. Health and Human Services Secretary Javier Becerra emphasized the need to work collaboratively to ensure safe access to reproductive rights. I'm thrilled to get to join the Vice President as she continues to go around the uh, country to educate and to talk the truth about what's going on. Several times, protesters disturbed the discussions, yelling at the Vice President to push for a ceasefire in Gaza. They were escorted out, and many in the audience chanted four more years, seemingly in support of the Biden administration with the election ahead this November. This was the second stop of her tour in the fight for reproductive rights. I think it's uh, very eye-opening and the need to fight. The fight goes on every single day. Super you know, happy to be here. Um, really excited as a youth activist. This is the, the work we're putting in with the California Democratic Party. So I'm just like really excited. In San Jose, Teresa Estacio, Cron 4 News.